The first patient through the clinic's doors today is Emma Helmka Wilson, and there's no hiding her condition. I just don't feel normal. I feel a freak, and I, I feel like I should be in a circus. I suffer from excess facial hair. Mm -hmm. I've tried waxing, um, yeah. electrolysis, I pluck. I've done pretty much everything. I'm hoping that there's something that you can do to help. Is the hair just on your face or do you have hair elsewhere? I've got some in my cleavage, around my nipples, on my stomach. And treatments that you've tried to date haven't successful? Well, they take the hair away until it's back again a couple of weeks later. So, no. Around One in ten women suffer from excessive bodily and facial hair. It's often quite unusually large levels of the male hormone testosterone in the body. I would love to be able to go out in public, talk to other people. But I'm a recluse now. I might as well not exist anymore. We have to get your hair sorted. Has anyone ever talked to you about laser treatment? No. Because laser treatments today are amazing um, and they really can achieve a, hopefully a permanent hair loss. Okay, that's all right. Great. Yeah. Okay. Here today, gone tomorrow. It's time for 37-year-old Emma to have her excess hair lasered. As treatment works on the follicle beneath skin, it's actually better to be clean-shaven. The laser beam disables the follicle and prevents the hair from growing. Hair, of course, Emma's, is going to take around six treatments, but with each treat, you can see results.